Today's video is about the boring punch out drill, but there's always something to gain and we'll talk about how to spice it up. So we know that the basic punch out drill helps with your shoulder endurance and maybe a little bit of cardio, but I think that there's something more you can do to keep yourself engaged and get a little more out of it. So I say 30 seconds on hard with a 15 second active rest. As you can see right here, I'm choosing to do a one, two, one, two, one, two combination. Choose one combination to go hard with for 30 seconds. That way you don't have to think too, too much. Then during that 15 second active rest, you can decide whether you're gonna move around, move your head in place or keep your hands up. I think moving around is the best bet. It's the most realistic Think about it. 20 seconds on, 30 seconds going hard. And then you probably move around catching your breath and getting your strategy back together. You can also switch the combinations up. I like this drill right here because I think it would be good for building your cardio so you can run up the points. And then also, I think this would be a good drill to potentially finish someone on the ropes who thinks that they're Muhammad Ali when they're not. You know, a lot of guys like to sit on the ropes with their high guard up thinking that that will save them from everything. But that's not the case. And that's why you need to switch up your punches to throw hooks around the high guard. Maybe some uppercuts in there as well to split the guard and possibly get to finish. A lot of reps look at unanswered points like nuclear bombs, even if they're not really hitting hard. They're like, ooh, 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 ooh. So yeah, that gives you another reason to try this drill out. Hopefully it gives you some success. Follow me for more.